Hello, what's up, what's up people? Welcome to my channel. My name is Fresha and I'm here with a very interesting video of how to do a very, very simple hairdo that comes in handy for events, may it be weddings, everything. I'm here for that. So I'll show you the things that you require to do this style. One of it being a crochet hook, the one that I'm trying to show you. It's called a crochet hook, but what you wanna eat and a crochet, that's it. And I've already showed you a comb, that's a tail comb over there. Gel, the type of gel that I'll be using to achieve this hair look. Yeah, guys. That's me doing my hair i'm combing it actually after i and i undid my bantu knots i decided that i'll not wash my hair i'll start with doing this hairdo because it's a gel yarn and my hair i could dirty so i want to do this hairstyle we'll start with parting you see that i'm trying to part in a c-shaped manner like so mm -hmm like so it's coming through guys mm -hmm. Hevo. uh-huh that way guys then i'm trying to make sure my line is straight although while doing your hair there are very very high chances that your lines as talk was straight so i'm trying to make them straight mm -hmm. after putting the first part I'm using my caband to tie the rest of my hair like so. Actually guys, this hairstyle, I did it overnight. Because the sis must slay tomorrow. Yeah, being a Monday, I have to slay. Okay? So, we'll start with detangling our hair with a comb like so. That was the use of it. Then use our gel to slick down everything to make sure everything has slicked down mm -hmm. i'm applying gel like so and i'm not doing overdoing it i'm just applying little of it the one that you need to enough like so mm -hmm. making sure everything has slicked down uh -huh. i'm adding a little gel because i felt like it's not enough for me like so mm -hmm. Then I'm using my brush. In a brush, fuck up here to rank guys. I do not have a Diana brush, so I use that brush, guys, to make sure everything has slicked down in a cut in a cut awesome, like so. Uh huh. Then I'll be using my black rubber bands. Mm hmm. There's two small, two tiny black rubber bands, and I'll be securing my first part with them like so guys that's me nikichukoto to blada like so then i i'm going to secure the first part using the bladders like so mm -hmm. you see how everything has slicked down and it's already the first part guys i still had to slay the following day actually this is still i did it Usiku, then I cause nili paka gel nili malizia the following morning before I went to work. Mm -hmm. Cause I had to slay. Uh, it was on a Monday. I had to slay. I had to look good. Eh? Cause when you, you okay, cause when your hair looks good, honestly, your confidence shoots up to a hundred percent, and you feel good about yourself. Mm -hmm. That's me parting the second part, and I said I'm parting it with like C sections, not straight lines, they are like C sections. And since I am doing everything that I did on the first burn, first type of burn, I'll be applying gel like so. Mm -hmm. Then later on, detangle it. After applying gel that is enough, I'll detangle everything with my brush. Mm -hmm. But then guys, I saw this hairstyle on Pinterest and I was like, sis, let's recreate this. 
I'm very happy it turned out amazing and it was even my first time doing it. I saw this on Pinterest. I was like, sis, let's do this. Mm -hmm. That's me applying gel, making sure it's enough for that second section, for that second part. Actually, I got distracted. We were talking with someone. I was doing this hairstyle with someone, a cure apple, so I was talking to the person. That's me detangling everything like so making sure everything has slipped down nothing is left out then of course using my rubber bands i'm going to secure the second section with my rubber band and i told you guys in afakua c section do not nini do not part your hair if you are very straight okay like so that's me making sure everything has slipped down and everything is in place in a kapua yani yeah that's it and on to our third section guys actually we're repeating the same thing that we did on the first band the second band that's what we're repeating on this third band i'm just parting my hair following my instincts guys Kama you can't follow your instincts, neither to me uh, your phone camera would pick a picture you see what you are doing. But me I was so sure and I find everything that is right. I love you. See Lazima that that part what will I say? It's not supposed to be that perfect. Cause after all, we are going to crochet our extension onto it. It's not a must. It were very straight and very perfect. That's me detangling my hair, making sure everything is detangled. Mm -hmm. Then using my gel, I apply it that way. Mm -hmm. Actually, I did not want to use too much gel because I was so sure this hair style, I would stay with it for about one week or two weeks because a sis can do a year by the way guys this year we are saving our own coins imagine i used one pack of this the hair that i'll be showing you it's fluffy kinky guys i used half of it and i bought it at 300 bob imagine i used half of it meaning i spent 150 bob on these guys this year we are supposed to save our coins you are not going to give them our coins simwaka we are doing it on our own. We are saving our own coins, all right? Imagine this year still cost me 150 bob. I bought the year at 300 bob because obviously was using half of it. I bought it at 300 bob and used half the packet. That's me making sure I've secured my third band. Mm -hmm. it, making sure everything has slicked down and I've said this part is not supposed to be that perfect because we'll be crocheting our hair on it alright yeah that's it that's basically it guys on to the last section guys we are detangling everything using our comp like so uh, actually you can freestyle this hairstyle See, lazima in a four part you can have six of them three of them mimi i just did according to my head guys if you have a smaller head than me uneza fanya lesser bands than me if you have a bigger head than me you can do more bands than me all right making sure i'm making sure everything has slicked down nothing is left behind with my brush yaku brush viatu guys i'll get that diana brush guys we'll grow all right then um i'll be securing the last band using some rubber bands of course uh-huh and make sure everything eco into place nothing is left behind everything has clicked down together like so guys yo this is style it's a very very perfect one for those wedding events nanya kona wedding i come i already have a hairstyle 
Mm-hmm. Actually, I have so many hairstyles for you guys, for those events, for those weddings, for that photo shoot, for your birthday photo shoot. I have everything in store for you guys. So kindly subscribe, click on that notification bell so that anytime I upload a video, you'll be notified that I have uploaded one. Kindly comment. Actually, comment down down below everything that you want to know about this hairstyle, and I will be I I will engage with you. Then we'll make sure we securing everything because you see my hair eco just natural there is no nothing that I've done on it so I'm going to twist then use my the my black rubber bands to secure it I intazungusha to that car car twist like so and use the rubber band to secure it like so I'll be repeating this process on the four sections Na hapo cause my hair was too thick I did uh, a braid is it a braid a matuta like so to make sure everything nothing is left out guys so that it will be easy for us to crochet everything like we're into place and looking nice looking yummy yeah that's what I'm trying to mean then of course after doing the matuta i'll be using my rubber bands to secure it to secure it like so mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i hope you're understanding this guys if there's any question you have kindly comment down below i engage with you guys i reply all your comments actually i do reply all my comments and i'll be glad to help you where you're not when you drip what is going there i basically do this up all my matutas like so mm -hmm. evil just like that guys on the last matuta i'll braid it like that because obviously see as if you care with my two hands secure koju so that's what i basically do appears that you choke you know you you do anything possible possible no si choke then using my rubber bands i'm securing it like so mm -hmm. then i'm going to tie my hair using a durag guys because i did this year style overnight actually i started it overnight nikai malizia subina mapma before i went to work so I'm going to put my durag ni lale ni amke kesho asubuhi to finish with my hair style. This it's just that guys. After playing gel unangoje kauke cuz me I did it at night. Obviously I had to wait for it to ikauke. And we are going to use fluffy kinky color one i used half a pack of this type of hair guys i used just a half of it that's how reliable and convenient this hairstyle is and of course you can as well as rudisha come after metal i used this kawanka pack this just this one so i'm showing you how to do it we are going to unravel it twice marambili just like so when you nafanya uh-huh make sure you have to whatever just like that i'm taking the other one showing you how to unravel it just like that you divide it into two equal halves just like so guys uh-huh for this hairstyle and i told you guys i used half a packet of this this is me guys the following morning after i've woken up and washed my face i'm trying to give myself that psyche of the so i'm singing i already knew i'm doing a voice over for this hairstyle so i had played on my music that's the hair after detangling it that's half the packet and we are going to use a crochet braid, crochet hook to do this hairstyle. Okay, in short, that crochet nila yetuna itanga crochet. That's what I'm calling crochet because that's the right pronunciation. 
that's a crochet hook um honestly i don't know how i i will explain this just look we learn to you just unaingiza kwa your natural hair it's a protective style guys and i'm so sure it won't damage your hair it's something that i've done niko nayo sai kwa kicha while doing this voice over na yezi damage your hair that's me with my crochet hook na ka vizuri so that i show you the back part as i told you guys that back part si lazime kwa that perfect and you can see yangu it's not that perfect because i know very sure that i'm going to crochet everything into place uh -huh. unaingiza crochet like that then you pick the rest of your hair unazingiza hapo ndani like so okay i don't know how i will explain this for you i hope you just watch and learn can you really just tell me i will explain to you everything that i'm doing kindly comment down below if there's a part you want me to explain and elaborate up about just like so guys Let's crochet guys. You just insert your crochet crochet hook then you your natural hair. Then you go pick uh what will I say guys? Let me try doing it. You insert your crochet hook on your natural hair like so. I love your uh, nini hair extension una yekapo. Close your crochet hook. Then after that unachukua the rest of the hair unaingiza hapo in a form like a knot. That's what I'm trying to explain to you guys. I hope you will understand. Just watch. Most of this work guys you will know by just watching and learning because explaining can be a little bit tricky for me and for you guys. Naweza kwa whatever I'm saying, uelewi just watch. Watching is the right thing to do here. Make sure you crochet everything at the back part of your We are crocheting the first part. We've already crocheted the first part from behind. Now we are crocheting on the second part from behind, the second parting from behind, and we are going to do it halfway. I I know you'll understand this with time what I'm trying to mean. That's what we'll be doing. <laughs> I was dancing, guys. I was so sure I'm going to do a voiceover for this video. So I had Nini Nili Kwani make a music. I was listening to music as we yeah so we are going to crochet that second part like so mm -hmm. you just unengiza crochet evil then i hope you've seen everything that i've done there because honestly i don't know the right way to explain this but i just hope you see most of these things you just watch and learn explaining is a little bit tricky Una eka crochet yako hivyo then you put your hair extension just like so unafunga your crochet then you vuruta hivyo alafu una make that kahole ya kuweka the rest of the hair extensions like that 
you form a knot. You see that? Mm-hmm. The hairstyle is coming through, guys. This was my first time doing this, and I'm very proud of myself. I saw this hairstyle on Pinterest. The lady who had it, Ali Kwanaka, poor. And I love, love Niger vibes a lot. Like, a lot. I just love Niger vibes. So, we'll crochet like so. In this second section from behind, we are going to crochet it halfway. Atuta crochet nyuele apambele from your hairline to just like, is it half a centimeter? Your hair itakuwa crocheted. You leave it just like that to make everything look natural. Yeni ikayeni kama ni nyuele yako umefanya hivu. I hope you're getting what I'm trying to mean. Yeah. You just crochet Eve or two. Mm -hmm. You form that knot. Like, so it's very simple and easy to do. We are done with the last two parts, last two sections. I hope you're seeing how I've crocheted it. Hukumbele on that third part. My, some part of my hair but at least it's a natural it's kind of your hair that you've done like that then this hair that I'm showing you we are going to use it to make some burn kind of this situation up on belly like so you just use that bladder okay I hope you've seen what I've done there then unazungusha it form like a bun just simple you make sure you equalize everything according to your preference guys i'm you just do the way i've done mine just like so mm -hmm. then after doing it you are going to secure it using rubber bands that means seeing it's not making sense so na repeat tena uh-huh Um, a showering. I know the meaning of a shower, guys. So, I'm So, that's me dancing. <laughs> on whose wedding day? Munita Arusi, by the way, I already have a hair style for your event. I have a hair style for that event. So, that's me preparing my hair for the second band. The second and the last band, actually. Uh huh. Then I detangle them using my hair like so. Mm -hmm. Now because it's not enough. Just like that. Uh -huh. Then I'm going to use my rubber band. So I'm trying to just to anisha them. Donyeze kutumia one of them. The watu zilikuwa zimeshikana. Ona venye nilikuwa serious while doing it. Yeah, guys. Uh, after detangling it, after kutoa nisha, so I'm going to use it to make like a door handle. You'll see in a few. Ntengeneze kutu inaka handle. Uh -huh, just like that. Nashikanyole yako hivo. Then, unatengeneza hiyo handle. Just like so. It's not that visible, but I hope you saw it on the first burn, how I did it. So, tunatumia hiyo, we put it there on our second burn, just like that. Mm -hmm. Then, you create a burn like situation actually it's a burn so you unatengeneza a burn mm -hmm. unazungusha tu like that uh -huh. then after finishing it you just use your rubber band mine are, are black ones and I'm using them to secure the band no isitokane Let's cut the flyovers, guys, making sure everything is in the right size. As in this, I'm just equalizing everything like so. 
cutting the excess mm -hmm, just like that give her two guys and detangling everything using my hands using my fingers uh-huh that way mm -hmm. <laughs> that's me dancing dancing you don't need to but you'll teach me how to dance mm -hmm. that's basically it and that's the end of this tutorial i hope you enjoyed it kindly comment down below if you love love this hairstyle now come on you can't do it go tell your hairstyle stylist stylist akufanyie this is the end results guys i hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial if you have any questions kindly comment down below and i'll be very very ready to help you out i love you guys very much for watching this video up to the end continue watching my content guys i appreciate a lot that's fresher being fresher guys i was dancing i think that's me dancing guys <laughs> <laughs> okay i hope you enjoyed this video until next time kindly if you try it out tag me on instagram comment down below car you will try it out and i will appreciate a lot click on that subscribe button that notification bell so that anytime i upload a video you'll be updated that i have uploaded one Bye bye guys, I love you and I hope you enjoyed this hair tutorial. Bye!